Hey folks, my name is Laducium. Welcome back to my continued Let's Play of The Walking Dead. Uh, based on the comics, slightly off the TV show, I guess, I don't know. Anyway, it's a lot of fun. I am having fun. It is a five-part game series. Please visit the official website. <laughs> I don't know, I just noticed that scrolling across the top there. Uh, it is an episodic game from Telltale Games. It's an adventure-esque game. It's a new interactive story adventure game. I would qualify the genre as. And uh, I am having fun. This is my first Telltale games like this that I'm playing. Uh, I know uh, The Wolf Among Us is a new one out there, uh, which I will be checking out eventually. Um, I'm going to wait for it to go a little bit on sale, a bit more. It was on sale actually last week, but I'm going to wait for it to go on further sale before I buy it. And uh, on a side note, I just watched the VGX Awards earlier today. Uh, those were the Spike Video Game Awards. Uh, and one of the things I saw, which was really cool, I thought, was the fact that Telltale announced that they're working on a um, Game of Thrones uh, interactive game, which is sounds awesome. I think that would be amazing. I just hope they do it off of the books. Um, a Song of Ice and Fire. Um, where's the fire and ice? Why, why can't I remember? But uh, I always get that confused. It's my selective list, list dexia. Uh, but anyways, I hope they do it off the books and not necessarily off of the TV show. But in either case, I think that is fantastic and I can't wait for that to come out. Um, enough uh, talking. Let's get to the playing. So I am on episode one. <clears throat> We will continue playing, I guess. That's cool. I could copy the episode so I can make different decisions. I have a feeling I'm going to be replaying this game. I might not be refilming the replays, but I'll probably be replaying this simply because... Uh, and episode 2, 3, wow, 4, and 5. And then 400 Days is the expansion. Uh, I have a feeling I'm going to be replaying this be simply because it's too cool like to... Uh, try again make different decisions but not right now um, right now I'm gonna record and just have fun and see what happens so let's kick right in hey and there. get right back to this is Glenn and Glenn. Uh, I'm kinda in a jam here uh, little girl if you're there can you put your daddy on the phone or on the talkie or whatever this is Lee what's up so I'm down at that motor inn and well, uh, I'm I wonder stuck. if it's the same voice stuck. actor. Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. Or if I'm it's actually me, Glenn uh, from the show that's, that's the voice Glenn's actor, is what I mean. The motor in. Hey, Glenn, we're going to talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm going to hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Alrighty. Everyone's up for a jog. Um, as I was about to say... Uh, there's not going to be that much commentary in these Let's Plays. Of course, if you've been watching the previous ones, uh, you'll know. Um, and that's simply because there's just a lot of story going on, so there's not much for me to say, but more of it's interacting and seeing what here. happens with the story. Are you sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's, uh, really sweet. Don't mention it. Bow chicka wow wow. Um. Hey. We've already conversed. I'm gonna get back to him now. So, yeah, not much to say. So I can move around with my WASD keys. We've already been there. Uh, let's take another we can't energy let bottle. Anything happened to Ducky? I know, honey. <laughs> Ducky. Um, I don't know why that makes me laugh. Ice cream menus. Let's check those it's out. All melted now. Well, that's upsetting. Hey, Lee. You really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. 
Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? It's good. Her family is dead. Well, her family's dead, so... Uh... That's awful, Lee. <laughs> yeah, well... She seems to be handling herself all right. <laughs> she's just a little girl, Ken. Lee says she spent days on her own. That takes toughness. But you have no idea what sort of emotional damage is happening to her every second her family is gone. <laughs> I'm, I'm laughing because I just realized post-zombie apocalypse, um, like... 20 years after everybody's recovered there's going to be a booming psychiatry industry um you know just uh all the people overcoming all the emotional trauma why am i laughing uh what's the plan <laughs> are you guys all right or are you We're guys just all right? fine considering how about you duck quack we've all been through a lot that would make the game perfect if he just communicated what's in the quacks. plan hang tight i suppose Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? Uh, let's tell them. They, uh, own this place. They, uh, pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. They're, uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah? We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves. Over we it. killed that boy. <laughs> we could have saved him together. No, the we zombies can't could. kill you Bad because things of it. Happen. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. Yeah, you we think did. you do when you look back on we it. We actually. But in a moment, when things are really out of control. No, we made that choice. You don't have any choice. I'm, I'm Guess. pretty sure we made that choice. Try to let it go. I like the, by the way, I like the art style of the game. The cell shading, just, it looks really good. I like most art styles of most games. We just need so. to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. Let's, uh, talk to good old doing? Duck here. If you don't mind, I think my family and I are gonna rest for a bit. Let me know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. You got it. Duck like a candy it's bar. It's not much, but here, for the boy. Energy oh, bar. thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. Duck. Quack, quack, quack. It's my first day. Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? The elusive batteries. We got them. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead cards. That's another industry that I expect will boom uh, after the zombie apocalypse. Oh, snap. No family photo? Or no photo of Lee? Alright, uh, I guess we can... Let's look at the cork board. The IT IT guy. Cool. Uh, so nothing there. Talk to this dude. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? No. Not now. Because we already did. All right. <laughs> Let's, uh... This battery should fit the radio. Great. Thanks. Don't sound too excited. I'm still looking for batteries for that thing. Thanks. I appreciate it. Um, hmm. I thought we... Hey, Carly. I better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, uh, by the way. Don't mention it. 
Just remember what I said. Yeah. I will. I'm confused. I thought we just put a battery in the radio. I found this remote in the office, but I'm pretty sure the batteries won't fit. It needs the big stumpy ones. Yeah, these are no good. Big stumpy ones, that's the technical term. Here, I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't eat it? Oh, uh, yeah, she might, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, give it to her. I can take care of myself. Okay. No, it's okay. She survived for days uh, on her own. Doesn't need food. See? Doesn't need food. How's your finger, Clem? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, no. You know. We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. Cool. Check down on Clementine. Seriously, I can't wait for uh, Game of Thrones. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. That's the ATM. Alright, I guess we need to go rescue Glenn. I cannot wait for the Game of Thrones uh, game of this. Hey there. Uh, it's going to be awesome. You ready to head out? I'm ready to it. head out. You? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I think I've Let's looked go. at everything that's around. So, I believe when I started this, I chose the standard UI, which gives me hints about stuff that I can click Shit. on. Get down! Yeah, it gives me hints about stuff I can click on. I wonder if I did minimal UI, if I would have to uh, just kind of mouse around, did you see that? hoping for the best. I sure did. <coughs> Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn! Uh, right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way! We gotta go! Now! Listen, I was out here looking for gas, and then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you! Now let's go! We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about it if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. All right. Look around. That guy is obviously going to come back to life. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Cool. Alright. Uh, peek over wall, W. Talk to Glenn. Nothing here. Let's talk to Glenn first. Be careful peeking around. If they get on our scent, we're toast. Mmm. Toast. Oh, man. She's eating something. So we got that one right there, close. We can probably make it over to the RV, or down to the truck if we're quick and quiet about it. Where to next? If we're gonna kill all these guys, we're going to have to sneak around. Okay. There's a pillow over there. That's about as far as I got when it came to supply gathering. I might have an idea for it. Uh, is it putting it over the zombie's head? Good luck smothering them to death. That 
it's not really what I have in mind. You could use the pillow on the gun. No? I'll cover you if you sneak over to the RV. We can probably make it over to the RV. Or down to the truck if we're quick and quiet about it. We can hide by that RV if we're quiet and keep our heads down. Okay. Start snick sneaking. Snicking. Snickering. Hey, guy. We're a little naked out here, except for Carly's gun, and we can't use that much. Says you. Okay. Can't peek too much. And I guess we don't want to sneak out there. We're going to need weapons. So I guess I can use the pillow on that zombie. Well, I got one pillow and two corpses. An age-old problem. Anything up top? Nope. Uh, and Glenn is of no use. So I guess I could sneak back to the brick wall. I'm not sure I can take them both out myself, even if I had a weapon. I think you're gonna need more than your fists, man. We're a little naked out here, except for okay. Carly's gun, and we can't use that much. All right, I still have no idea what I'm supposed Let's to do. Back to that wall, safe there. Yes, we're going back to the wall. Anybody? There's a truck over there. Maybe we can find you a weapon. We should keep looking around for weapons. Where's the truck? Ah, uh, there's the truck. We can hide by that pickup. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. You need to find a weapon. Let's keep looking around. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. That was sick. I was pro. I'm very pro. All right. Random spark plug that's on the seat for some reason. They really want to get into that room. They really want to get into that room. All right. It's a sparky thing. Spark plug. <laughs> that's the technical you term. You should hold on to that. Could come in handy. All right. Can't stay up there too long. We can get that guy by the wall over there, I bet. Yeah, but there's another guy, isn't there? I prefer cover that can't just roll away. Alright, we've determined there's not much by the truck there that we can work with. There's an axe, if I could get to it. Not much there. All right, let's find out if we can do something with the car. It was awesome. <laughs> All right, so we're back by the truck now. She's right above us, guys. You need to find a weapon. I was trying to get that. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. I can go into the fucking pickup. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. 
Now we just have to get it quietly. Spark plug, don't fail me Wait. now. Let me see the spark plug. The porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. want to rescue here's the question do we really want to rescue somebody who cries that much that could scramble a brain pretty good that's exactly what i was thinking be careful getting up close to these guys i can't always cover you let's start taking these guys out can i take that guy out all right i guess we need to go back to the wall Pick this guy in the brain. This is my clever. Or woman. Whatever. I just ice picked in the brain. This is my clever I hope plan. That girl's okay. <laughs> oh, obviously. The one I ice picked in the brain is not okay. But that's okay. I'll wait for him to get closer. Nope! Crap. Apparently, you can hit him in uh, other parts of the body if you miss. And another Dude, one where'd down. your weapon go? Into that ice pick sized hole. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? <laughs> another one down, another one down, another one bites the dust. Two more. That should help. All right. Nothing else we can do here, so I guess we head upstairs. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay. We'll be right behind you. Excuse me, I'd like to ask you something. Thank you. Rad. Knock, knock. Hello in there. We're here to help. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. I wouldn't do it, but... All right. Here's Jody. Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. You're hurt. Oh, God. I... I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away! I'm bit! But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? Glenn? <laughs> I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please go. Okay, we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. I'm not taking her with us. 
You oh. have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please. I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Yeah. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No! And then shoot, shoot her. Huh? I've seen what hell is like, and it's coming back as one of those things. Shoot her! Help her out here. You're insane! Just take this thing! Thank you so much. I know how terrible this must be. We can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? Why not? Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. Can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. I'm here with you. You're a good man. Damn. Tootin. Still funny when people fall down. And Never everyone all right? Be getting yeah, that room to pause back. Calls, but Glenn is fine, and well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Alrighty. Well, folks, me thinks I played. Uh, I'm not quite sure how long I played, but I think it's probably been around somewhere between 20 minutes and half an hour. So I am going to put a break in the video right here. And uh, when we come back, we'll play some more. Uh, I have a feeling this will be a pretty long Let's Play series because <laughs> that guy's still having heart problems. Um, it's going to be a pretty long Let's Play series simply due to the length of the game and the conversations and all that stuff. I hope you guys are enjoying this. I hope uh, if you do, please leave a like, hit subscribe if you want to uh, get updates whenever I post new videos. And I will see you folks in a little bit. Later.